My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Only 100 miles on an over-the-top concourse, highly detailed restoration on this numbers-matching 1969 Dodge Dart 340 Swinger. Right here, I've got a first-place award from an all-Mopar show, but I'm telling you, the paintwork is amazing, really about as nice as I've ever seen. The motor compartment is uh, it, it doesn't get any better. So the car top to bottom is amazingly clean. It's a beautiful car. Dart 340. They're quick little cars. Great, great muscle car. Go to volocars.com and that's where you can read all the specs. That's where you can see all the pictures top to bottom. And that's where you find the prices on all of the collector cars we have for sale. Visit volocars.com. If you enjoy watching our video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on that bell icon and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. But right now, why don't you join me and let's go for a spin. Yeah, fit and finishes are just, just uh, over, over the top on this car. I mean, it's amazing. The bottom of this car is just as slick and glossy as the top. All the frame rails, floor pans, all the factory seams and pinch welds are all clean and it is painted smooth and glossy and clear coated. Uh, the gas tank is shiny. Uh, all the uh, components, the whole front end's all rebuilt. So all the steering, suspension, front and back is all new, all redone, all new bushings, shocks, etc. And it's all detailed. Every nut and bolt and component is nice. Uh, new dual exhaust system with the correct uh, chrome tailpipe tips coming out the back. Um, you look up at the motor, the motor is spotless. Uh, it is VIN number matching 340 motor. I think these are stamped down by the oil pan, but I have pictures of that on our website. It has a correct 727 uh, automatic, not VIN number match, but it's a correct one for this car. Eight and three quarter rear end. Uh, brake systems all redone, all new brake lines, fuel lines. Uh, bottom of this car, you could eat off of it but I wouldn't want you to because I don't want to get the car dirty. The body is way better than it left the factory. Uh, I mean, literally, I'm looking in the reflection and I use the term mirror finish, but it, it is literally a mirror. I'm looking at the reflection of the ceiling. It's like a blue mirror and it's like that everywhere I look. The gaps are right on the money. Everything lines up. It's the original color, B3 blue. They call it light blue. Uh, there is metal flake. And it's all laid out evenly. The clear coat is glossy and polished. This is all spot on. And it is just as smooth down here as it is up on top. Got the correct antenna. The emblems look new. Is the Mopar Pen Star. This is all immaculate. There's no cloudiness or blotchy in the clear coat or I mean in the metal flake all the gaps are beautiful this is all super nice got the dart swinger decal put on real nicely no cracking no bubbles no nothing I'm not seeing anything all of this is mint you know a lot of times they're still cars so you'll find some sort of imperfection but I'm not finding any and this is just slick tail lights are just sparkling show chrome on the bumper not regular chrome but that's show chrome finish the glass is real nice and clear all the moldings are polished and shiny these windows roll up and down so smooth they all fit real nice new door uh, handles the gaps are real nice no bubbles this is just as nice as the other side the mirror looks like new chrome vent window frames and rubber all this is really nice Windshield's been replaced. The 340 four barrel trim here looks real nice. It's got the fender mounted turn signals. Those were an option. The grill is all restored. Show chrome on the bumper. This motor compartment, like holy cow. 
very well the best detailed motor compartment I've ever seen. It is immaculate. Completely stock, other than the finishes, might be a little glossier than it was when it left the factory. But it is spotless in there. Look how nice the windows fit. The doors shut like a new car. The interior is just as nice. Real nice new carpet on the floor. It fits really good. Does have some aftermarket dart swinger rubber floor mats. The seats are all reupholstered and it fits real nice. Cushions are firm. Headrests are redone. Uh, the original blue seat belts has a full set of them in really nice shape. Inside the trunk is painted just gorgeous paint. Under the mat, it's all clean metal, it's all painted blue, and it's all clear coated. So all of this is shiny, beautiful paint. Has new uh, rear seat divider, new trunk mat, new weather strip, new stickers. The trunk light works. This door shuts just as nice as the other side. Yeah, that's nice. Door panels, window cranks, uh, new. The metal's painted nice. The guy even put sticky uh, plastic over the sill plate so they don't get scuffed. The whole instrument panel's real nice. Dash pad's new. Instruments are real nice and clean. Uh, and everything works. The AM radio works. The little tiny light over the ignition key works. Glove box light works. There's a switch under the dash that says map light. You turn that on and the lights come on. All new wiring, new master cylinder, every bracket, alternator, power steering pump, uh, horns, all looks like new. The washers are hooked up. It has the original manifolds, even has heat shield still on the exhaust manifold over here. It has reproduction hoses and clamps. It has reproduction Mopar plug wires, correct valve covers, restored air cleaner, Mopar radiator uh, with the right shroud. It's an actual Mopar reproduction battery. It's all bolted down properly. It has new cables. Just immaculate in here. It also comes with the owner's manual. I actually got on the floor and looked up under the dash. It's like brand new. The heater box is all restored. Uh, the firewall's painted blue. Uh, the brackets and pedals and wiring, everything under the dash is show quality. The door jams are slick. The weather strips are all replaced. Headliner's new, fits real tight. Dome light works, mirror is new. The visors are excellent, but they're original. You can just tell by the threads. Some of them are frayed a little bit. Uh, but the, the steering wheel, all that's real nice. The pedals. So now it's that time where I fire it up. These little Dart 340s are fun cars. They, they are spunky. It does have an, amp, an oil pressure gauge below the dash, so you can keep an eye on the oil. I just have to find the right key. Only 100 miles. It's a Mopar collector. He's had this car the last four years. Got power steering. So when they rebuilt the motor, they put in a cam that's just one step hotter. I do have the cam card. It's in the owner's manual, actually. It's so nice under there. I don't even want to close it. I want to look at it. strong brand new coker redline reproduction tires the rims are painted the dog dish hubcaps look pristine so this car is high high quality if you're a detail freak and you like having something that's about I won't say as close to new as possible better than new in a lot of regards uh, that's this car right here 
That's my impression, but you can go to volocars.com. Plenty of ways to contact the salesman. Uh, they'll answer any questions or concerns you may have. They can also help get this delivered anywhere in the country. They can help get you financed. Go to volocars.com. If you just like watching the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on that bell icon. You'll be notified as the new ones are posted. Thanks for watching.